Okay, video log. Uh, I'm doing maintenance on this uh, Honda, de 1986 Honda Delete, a Honda Elite <laughs> 150. This is uh, the uh, right side of the uh, bike with the plastics off. Take a look. There's your fuel tank, rear inner fender, muffler guard. And you can see the heat shield or whatever. See, there's just been burned through. But I don't think the muffler has been burned through at all. Uh, that's just the heat shield. Uh, you can see it looks a little oily and greasy underneath there. Okay. Again, this thing only has 9,000 miles on it. So, which means it's been doing a lot of setting. What does that mean? When you have a vehicle that's been doing a lot of setting, more than likely the carburetor got gummed up. Uh, and is uh, the float has been stuck a number of times probably. And that's probably why it looks like that underneath. I could be wrong, but I believe that's the reason for it. Other than that, there's no real reason for it um, to look like that. But then again, this vehicle has been sitting around like 33 years. I mean, it's like 33 years old, not been sitting around because it does have 10,000 miles, which is still super low, super duper low on a water-cooled engine. Yeah, check it out, guys. Pretty cool. I'll probably I'll probably be riding this more than my Honda Grand <laughs> when I get it done next year. I don't have to have it done this year. Uh, I'm just going to clean everything. I'm not going to really do anything different. I'm going to look into upgrading the rear suspension. Not that I need to, just to see if there's a cheap upgrade. The modern, I mean, modern shocks with the oil in them or whatever else. We'll see what's out there. Um, I got seafoam going through the carburetor really good right now. That's the only thing I've done as far as engine clean. And carbur I mean, carburetor clean is seafoam, which does a really good job. I'm going to spray all this down in a minute with some cleanser. I'm trying to find the smart plug. That's what I'm going to replace. The cold weather spark plug for easier starting. Yeah, this is the other side right here. Believe it or not, I'm having a problem getting this panel off. It's supposed to just come up, but uh, I'm struggling with it. But I'm going to take my time and not try to break it. There you go. Yeah, look at that, guys. Air cleaner. Look at that. Things in mint condition. It's just dirty. Dirty, dirty, dirty. I'm going to spray it all down. Though. Dirt's about to come up. Then we're going to see what we really got. Yeah, I'm just letting you guys get a good view of it. Of the internals and stuff and get up under there real good look at that yep 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 look, look at all that up in there gotta love the cell phone guys that's my rear suspension so it has dual shocks in the rear which is kind of nice i like it uh, look at that mill man look at that engine man casing and everything it's just nice guys honda quality i bought a cheaper scooter a little while ago and i was taking a cvt cover off <laughs> 